to create programs in MATLAB. Click on file, then click on new, then click on blank and file. This is MATLAB editor. This symbol is used to write comments. Now, write a program to print simple message to print simple message this is my first program now enter input in braces in single quote hello world now go to file save as Save it as p1.m. M is the extension of MATLAB. Save. Now close. Now write H E L P help p1. Enter. Write a program to print a simple message. Now p1. Enter. This is the output of the first program. Now click on file again on new again on blank and file my second program is how to add two numbers addition of two numbers first of all take a input a is equals to input in braces in single quote enter first number semicolon now again B is equals to input in braces single quote enter second number now C is equals to a plus B semicolon s printf single quotes sum of percent D and percent D is percent D comma a comma B comma C now press enter this symbol is used to run the program save and run now save it as p2.m m is the extension of MATLAB save close now, now enter first number is 2 second number is 4 we get the output sum of addition of two numbers that is 6 now my next program is comment using if statement to check whether the given number is even odd or odd to check whether the number is even or odd now first of all input a is equals to input braces single quote enter the number enter the number now semicolon now condition if in braces rem that is remainder remainder of a comma when a is divided by 2 is equals to 0 press enter s printf the number is even else s 
printf in single quotes the number is odd and go to file save as p3 dot m now type p3 and the number my number is 4 the number is even now again p3 now my number is 7 the number is odd now my next program is go to file new blank m file to implement switch switch program a is equals to input in braces in single quote enter the first number enter the first number then semicolon Select this statement and press Ctrl C, then click on next and Ctrl V. Now just edit second number B. Ctrl now. Now in switch program we make choices. So we have to write here choice is equals to input single quote enter your choice enter your choice now press enter remember that after this statement we does not use semicolon now switch switch choice now press enter case 1 C is equals to A plus B semicolon S printf in single quote sum of person D and person D is Percent D, comma A, comma B, comma C. Now press Enter. Second case is C is equals to A multiply by B, semicolon. You can also use display D I S P display C in place of S printf now press enter now otherwise enter display in single quote you enter a wrong choice C H O I C E wrong choice. Now press enter and then end. Go to file, save as P four dot M. Save. Now click P four. Enter the first number. First number may be two. Enter the second number may be three. My choice is 1. It gives addition of two numbers. 2 plus 3 is 5. Now again P4. Press enter. First number may be 4. Second number may be 3. Now my choice is 2. This gives the result 4 into 3 that is 12.
here my choice is 1 and my result is 5 here my choice is 2 result is 12 now p4 enter 4 enter second number is 3 enter now my choice is 3 which does not exist in the program so press enter you enter a wrong choice this is all about switch program now click on file new blank m file comment display n numbers using for loop n is equals to input in braces in single quote enter the value of n now semicolon disp display single quote natural numbers now press enter now for loop for i is equals to 1 colon n display i end go to file save as p5 dot m save now click on p5 enter the value of n 7 it display the numbers all natural numbers from 1 to 7 now my next program is go to file new blank m file my next program is to implement while loop to implement while loop now press enter i is equals to 3 while in braces i is greater than is equals to or 1 i is greater than or equal to 1 press enter s printf in curly braces in single quote hey this is my computer now press enter i is equals to i minus 1 semicolon and program again you can go to this this is used to save or run save it as p 6 dot m save now you can see here three statement hey this is my computer is executed three times why because now you can see here this is a current folder consists of all folders which i created now click on p6 then click on open this is our while loop program here value of i is 3 so this statement is executed 3 times now go to file new blank m file my next program is to find square root of a number using function 
a is equals to input single braces single quote enter the number semicolon because we don't want to execute it now sqr this is the syntax of function at the rate in braces a now a dot raised to power 2 semicolon now c is equals to s q r a semicolon now press enter display c or you can use s printf also now press enter now again go to file save it as p7.m save now go to you can type here help help p7 it shows the comment to find the square root of a number using function now write p7 enter the number now my number is 8 the result is 64 square root of 8 is 64 go to program 2 open it here here you can also calculate the average of two numbers by just writing c equals to a plus b divide by 2 this is all about matlab program